There's updates on Chris Jericho's WWE return when he comes back to the company. Let's get into today's news. Chris Jericho shocked the WWE Universe after he defeated Kevin Owens at Payback. Was not expecting that because Chris Jericho was going to go on tour at with his band Fozzie. So Chris Jericho was not going to win the WWE United States title and it wouldn't mean anything to him. Chris Jericho did not make that title mean anything. He didn't put prestige behind it. He didn't do nothing with that WWE United States title. He never defended it. The guy, ever since he won it, he's never done nothing with that title. And when Kevin Owens became the WWE United States champion, went to SmackDown Live, man, he made that title mean something. He put prestige behind it. When The Miz made the WWE Intercontinental title, realism. He put prestige in that Intercontinental title. He made that Intercontinental mean something. It was like one of the best titles on SmackDown Live. The Miz put so much love into the IC title. He was the person as a heel who would make that title mean something. And that's what Kevin Owens is doing as a heel as the United States champion. So that's why I disagree with Chris Jericho winning at Payback. The fans have been anticipating Jericho's run ending for months. So a title win was a surprise. There was some speculation about his run being extended, but the officials of WWE revealed their plan during this week's edition of SmackDown. Jericho lost the U.S. title back to Owens during their match, which I 100% agree with. Because, like I said, Kevin Owens is a great heel. He's a good aiming performer. I have a lot of interest in it. He draws me in with the realism that Kevin Owens brings as a United States champion. There's realism there. Chris Jericho was not champion material for United States champion. He was not champion material. Kevin Owens is definitely champion material. Because he makes that U.S. title mean something again. But all the titles are hurting right now, except the IC title. Now, as expected, Chris Jericho was also written off WWE television after a brutal attack from Kevin Owens. The angle has given more Owens heel heat. Well, that's good. You know, I'm happy that he's getting heel. I'm interested in that. It draws me in. I love it. That's the real Kevin Owens that we should get. Why are the fans hating it? Why are you guys hating it? Oh, well, he's a boring champion. He's a bad performer. He's fat. Oh, well, he he is a horrible champion. Chris Jericho is the best U.S. champion. I 100% disagree with that. Chris Jericho is not the best U.S. champion. Kevin Owens is a way better U.S. champion than what Chris Jericho was when he won it. So, moving to Backlash, Jericho won't be featured on television for the extended period of time. However, how long will this absent from him from his SmackDown? Well, unfortunately, there is no return for Jericho yet. However, the expectation is that he will be back on WWE television before the end of the year. Jericho will be doing the most of the summer with Fozzie to promote the new album. Most of the known tour dates are through June. On paper, Jericho may be sh back with WWE in July. Take it with a grain of salt. It could happen. It could not happen. But a longer hiatus than that, but he's definitely expected for WWE SummerSlam. So I'll keep you guys updated on all the Jericho news when he's returning, when he's not. I'll keep you guys posted with that news and that information when the report comes out. Now, since that's happening... Now we see Chris Jer Now we see Kevin Owens and AJ Styles. AJ Styles takes the United States title. And then we see a few between AJ Styles and Ty Dillinger. Good performers, good in the ring, town superstars, hard work in the ring. Ty Dillinger is over with the crowd. But I disagree with what happened when Ty Dillinger f had that match with that job or Aiden English. That's poor booking, that's bad creative, that's a bad idea. That was a bad decision that you put Ty Dillinger. It's been two long weeks. And then you put Ty Dillinger up against a jobber. I disagree with that 100%. That was a bad booking right there. 
Two weeks. And now you, then you put him up a job up against a jobber. So you have AJ Styles. Ty Dillinger for the U.S. title has a short run with it. Ty Dillinger beats AJ Styles, new U.S. champion. And then I predict that AJ Styles will be back in the main event around SummerSlam. Until then, what are your thoughts on Chris Jericho, guys? Drink it in, man. I loved Chris Jericho as a heel. He was a great heel. He drew me in. A lot of interest in it. I love the Chris Jericho as a heel. Drink it in, man. Or You just made the list. I loved it. It was very creative. It was very smart. I loved the Chris Jericho heel when he said, you just made the list. And I loved that. That drew me in. I had a lot of interest in the Chris Jericho as a heel. Um, so until then, guys, you let me know in the comments below. What are your thoughts about this? Until then, follow me on Twitter at the talk show 101. The link will be below. Articles below. Hit that thumbs up, guys. Leave a like on that episode. I appreciate it very much. Articles below. Subscribe.